Thanks for checking out this video. Today's video will be covering draft site commands that can be activated using function keys. Function keys initiate useful features in just one click of your keyboard, enhancing your productivity and time efficiency. Likewise, many of them correlate with status bar icons, which is especially convenient because they leave your mouse hand free to continue your drafting flow with no interruptions. These keys are located in the top row of your keyboard and are all labeled with an F followed by a number. Keep in mind that you may have to press the FN key in unison with function keys in order to activate them in your draft site application. So without further ado, here are the function keys and their designated commands. The escape key cancels your current command. F1 displays online help and is equivalent to the help command. F2 shows and hides your command history in a separate command window and is equivalent to the command history and hide command history commands. F3 turns entity snaps on and off and is equivalent to the entity snap and minus entity snap commands. F5 switches the isometric grid to the next isoplane and is equivalent to the isometric grid command. F7 turns the grid display on and off and is equivalent to the grid command. F8 turns ortho mode on and off and is equivalent to the ortho command. F9 turns snap mode on and off and is equivalent to the snap command. F10 turns polar guides on and off. F11 turns entity tracking on and off. Control plus F4 exit the drawing but not the program and is equivalent to the close command. Lastly, Alt plus F4 exit the program and is equivalent to the exit command. So try it out for yourself to do more with your DraftSite experience. If you're looking to learn more, visit the blog page or visit DraftSite.com.